get this day started. Alright guys, we're going to start our journey today. over into West Virginia. This is my office. This is what I get a look at every day. It's amazing. Beautiful day to get the truck washed. Alright, you guys been asking and asking. Well, here she is. 2013 T660. The motor is a 2012 Cummins 2250, and it's got 545 horsepower. Yes, obviously that's turned up. And she's got an MM2 tune. If you know what that means, kudos. If you don't, Google it. Don't ask me. Because <laughs> I won't answer. But she's got 1,850 torque, pound foot of torque. The rears are kind of messed up on this truck. Uh, not crazy about it. It's got two 253 rears. And... Um, you know, I thought that would be fine for fuel mileage. I thought it would increase my fuel mileage, but come to find out, and I learned this later, the transmission is a, what's what they call a one-to-one -one transmission. So I'm not even getting the benefit of those tall gears. A little bit, but not like, you know, not, not a typical transmission. The trailer is a Great Dane 48 foot 102 wide it's set up for a dump valve uh, but my truck is not set up for a dump valve so obviously where that's not working well, we got two toolboxes here in the back sturdy lights they're decent Tell you what, Great Dane builds a good trailer. Uh, if you get under here and inspect it, it's a pretty solid trailer. I'm not sure the distance on the cross members underneath, but uh, pretty solid. It'll hold firm. Yep, there she is. It's been a good trailer. Coming up the back side, there's the headache rack. It's exposed. I'm not crazy about that. I wish I had spent the extra money and gotten a box, enclosed box, for the headache rack. It's well worth the extra money. But, a little too late for that. There we go. There's the tour, guys. <laughs> I'll pop the hood here in a second. And there's that 2250. It's single overhead cam, so you can't go crazy with the horsepower and the torque. Now there's just too much load on the engine. One of the Achilles heels to this engine. Right down in there, the fuel pump. Part of the guts were uh, made of ceramic, and you have to get it updated because that ceramic can break pretty easily and uh, wreak havoc in about 200 miles if it breaks. So yeah, that's that's uh, really really bad. And 
The boost gauge. My favorite gauge. And here's the turbo side. This pipe right here, I actually put in, as well as, so you can get in there and see it, this one down here. I put, see that little valve right there? Makes life much easier for draining the coolant. Much easier. But there's the truck tour, guys. We'll do the inside another time. Guys, I hope you enjoyed today's vlog and I hope you enjoyed the tour. Uh, once again, that's a 2013 Kenworth T660. Uh, it is upgraded. It's got the custom wheel, extended gear shift, a little bit of chrome on the inside, but not much. Got a long ways to go for that. Uh, the biggest thing, though, really is the MM2 tune. That's, I mean, that's huge. 545 horsepower. You know, this really is owner operator spec uh, nowhere near what you're going to get at one of the mega characters uh, if i'm pulling hills <clears throat> i mean legitimately i can go up jellico and i went up with 77 and a half thousand pounds and barely had to drop tonight so she pulls really really well i know i talked about those rears earlier but you know she she's got all the power you need uh, probably probably honestly too much probably be cut back so you know this is a truck built for fuel mileage and that reflects um, you know, if I really keep an eye on my boost gauge and drive her you know, drive her like she's supposed to be driven you can get seven miles to the gallon plus all day every day and that's the aero design of this truck it's uh, it really is a good truck she treats me really well, but I treat her really well at the same time. So, anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the tour. Uh, give it a thumbs up. Over here. Give it a thumbs up uh, if you like the video. And click on one of these videos over that way uh, if you'd like to see some more. But until then, stay driven.